The Belize High School is on the path to establish the first of its kind national robotics competition in Belize following its successful representation of the country last August at the International Competition First Global. The institution has been tasked by the Ford Inspiration Recognition of Science and Technology to introduce robotics to students starting at the primary school level. So this past Saturday, students from five Belize city-based schools were exposed to the fundamentals, including Lego building and basic coding to move robots. As we looked at the elementary curriculum as it comes to coding and programming with ages 9 to 12 year olds, learning about Lego, learning about coding, learning about programming here in Belize for the first time ever in order to compete in a national competition. So what we did is we went out and we shopped for these kits from first last year called Into Orbit and we brought 40 kids. We invited 40 kids to come to our campus last Saturday so that we could teach them about building and working with the robots using science, technology, engineering and math. About 40 students are in the initial group benefiting from the program. And if you are thinking that the concept of robotics is way too advanced for young children, think again. The building of robots and programming them to move is about applying basic mathematics, problem-solving skills, and following instructions. And with children already into gadgets, interfacing with iPads and the like, nine-year-old Sophia Usher says it's about having a positive attitude. So I programmed this robot to do something that's called like a, a is so it's supposed to go over there and then turn and then go back to where that that says into orbit okay. and then I have to make sure that it goes the right way unless if it crashes then I have to fix it again which I have to go into my iPad and fix it again I have to change the degrees and the speed and where it needs to go while Sophia was about coding and programming, 11-year-old Daniel Sharp loves building with Lego, an advanced form of the children's toy that we know. When I build Legos, I think a little bit bigger. I use my imagination when I'm building from scratch. So think like this. Some people build this from using instructions, but I can build things without instructions. I've built things from scratch. What practice you had doing that? Well, since I was young, I've been building Legos since I was four. When I first used a Lego, I, I would build it, then I would break it later. But now, I have a shelf in my room, and, I, and that's where I store my Legos. It hasn't been a waste of time for me. It's, be, it's, gives, me, it's gives me better education. And this robot is a great piece of technology and building blocks. I would call Lego building the building blocks of my mind. Godfrey Sosa, who is the head of the Information Technology Department at Belize High School, says that in some ways, the program prepares students from an early age for career opportunities in this field. When, when we talk about robotics, we think maybe it's far-fetched because we're in Belize, but one of the things that we're trying to do here at Belize High School is trying to, trying to shift that, that mentality in terms of thinking that not because we're from Belize, we can't be exposed to these things. You see the idea of, of education is actually offering opportunities to kids, um, offering diverse um, opportunities. So we're moving away from the traditional, okay, I want to be a lawyer, I want to be a doctor, and so on. We have kids now studying uh, robotics in Mexico, which is a field called mechatronics. Now this is something far-fetched from what we as, as a reality had, had thought of as a career. We actually have kids studying robotics engineering. We have some actually going into artificial intelligence with robotics from Belize. So getting this exposure at this level offers for different diverse opportunities, career opportunities for Belizeans. According to Principal Jamie Lee Usher, the end goal is to have a national competition among the students. The ongoing summer program targets five schools, but there is a call for one school from every district to sign up for the robotics project. This is a great project and I hope that once this is put nationally that people will contact us about working with us um, because we would love for schools to be able to come here to Belize City and register maybe for as low as $50 and be able to take home the mat, the kit, the robot and their homework will be to get another school involved. So the point of this is passing it on. So we're doing this for free. We're going out there. I'm begging everybody I can think of 
in order to get this going so that we can have this shared across the country. Dwayne Moody for News 5.